Welcome back everyone. It's day two since I created my Twitter profile and I'm already up to 87 new followers, five mentions, and too many messages to count. Now the first thing I'm going to do is adjust my notification settings for Twitter. So as you can see I am now up to 145 new emails regarding my Twitter activity <laughs> and I don't think I need to be notified every time I receive a new follow, mention, and message. So, maybe you're smarter than me and you've already done this, but what you're going to want to do if you haven't is click on your profile picture in the upper right hand corner of your screen, go to settings, then click on email notifications, and it's a simple turn off. I don't want to receive any emails from Twitter. Alright, now that we have that settled, let's get back to Tweepy. The first thing we want to do is follow back everyone who has followed us first. Every good system is hopefully accompanied by some form of sustainability and we want to make sure we follow back everyone that is kind enough to follow us first. So let's get that taken care of. Awesome. Now that we're done with that, we will get back to the uh, to following new users once we until we hit our daily cap of 500. Now you may be thinking, wait a minute, where is the unfollowers part of this system? Well, let me show you. Tweepy doesn't let you unfollow someone for three days. So let me show you the the screen or the message you'll get. Users. Uh, followed cannot be unfollowed until three days have passed. Now this is to uh, protect us. This is to pre prevent users from getting their accounts suspended, which is never good. And it's just one of Tweepy's policies that, I, I don't know, they may have negotiated these policies with, um, with Twitter directly to protect their API. I, I have no idea. But anyway, that doesn't mean we can't unfollow people. Now, if you want to unfollow people right away, you have three options. Well, one, you can wait three days to unfollow people via Tweepy. That's not really immediate. Two, you can manually unfollow people directly on Twitter, uh, very time consuming. Or three, you can use a site called Unfollowers to begin unfollowing people while we wait for the three days to pass on Tweepy. I will introduce you to unfollowers in the next lecture. For now, I'm going to continue to follow users until my, I hit my daily limit. Feel free to skip to the next lecture if you've already done this yourself, or stick around for a refresher. So I'm going to continue to use my old profile, or my main profile, I should say. All right, now as you can see, um, how the profiles are presented, it's it's they're presented as your most the most recent followers of the the page you're requesting to follow the users from. So as you can see, many of these profiles I followed yesterday. Um, and to save time, I'm going to go ahead and skip to the page where I left off yesterday. All right, here we go. Now I'm going to use the same filters as before. Um, profile image, users only users with avatars. Date last tweeted, newer than a week. And then last action date, um, or friend or follower, sorry. Neither. Excellent. And, and once you have these filters in place, you can go to previous pages and follow from there. So I should have done that first. So let's go back to page one. So as you can see, there are 12 people that for, were, were skipped for whatever reason. I may have been following too quickly and not paying attention to the notifications in the bottom right hand corner. So we can, we can start from page one and continue on. Okay, 
no no users from page two. All right, I'm just gonna go back to page 17 to save some time. Excellent. So let's continue to follow. So if you're curious too, this is this is a way to tell um, how many how many followers uh, follows per day a page gets that you're tracking. Since since new profiles will always show up at the front of the or on the first page of Tweepy, you can just you can track from where you left off and see um, how many new followers that that particular page is getting each day. Which which may be interesting to you, if you if you're closely following their content and you want to emulate what they are doing on Twitter. See what we're at. We're at 209 or 223. Let's keep it going. So another thing you might want to pay attention to when following people, and, I, and I'm not, I'm not paying too close of attention. I'm just, just for the sake of this tutorial, I'm just kind of trying to speed through it. But you might see profiles that are undesirable to you. So I'm not even gonna click on this. I have no idea what it is. It could be some kind of pornographic account, and many of those do exist on Twitter. There are, there, are, there are very few rules on Twitter regarding content. So you, you might want to be careful uh, who you follow. And you can always unfollow them. And there's also a nice little option uh, if you see uh, a profile, if you're, if you're able to catch it. Um, you can safe list an account. And what that will do is remove it from the list and you'll never see it again. So that it, that's... That's also helpful. Four and four home stretch.
All right, we'll get four more in or, or so. Awesome. Looks like I hit my daily limit. 